lagging. Testing, testing. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> what the fuck is this movie? Like, seriously. Like, I am legitimately just so confused. Like, it's... It's a dramedy, that's what it is. It's a drama mixed with comedy because there are some legitimate good comedic moments in here and you know funny stuff and um, just stupid stuff all around. Um, yeah. Hello, my name is Walter and I guess this is a review for you. I, I, I don't, I don't know how to juxtapose that. I just, I am like, what? What did I just watch? The CGI is fucking horrible. It doesn't doesn't even look like a made for Netflix movie. This is just like pure shit. Like I'm just like this is so amateur to a point where I'm just like is it even worth getting angry about? Is it even worth fucking losing my mind to? It's just like I guessed every single thing that was going to happen in this movie and the girl, you know, she's trying her best, but she isn't doing the best job. I, I'm sorry to say she is, she might be on the list for a Razzie Award. I, I don't know, but she's a kid, so I don't, I don't think so. Oh God, this movie is so fucking pretentious. I wanted to poke its fucking eyes out and say, shut the fuck up. God damn you motherfuckers. Oh, I, I didn't even want to watch this movie, I was just like, oh, okay, I'm up for a popcorn movie, I'll, I'll fucking, I'll fucking do this shit. And five minutes in, I was like, oh, the funerals are pretty good, you know, they, they have a good set and everything, and in comes this fucking abomination called Ogja, I'm just like, what the, f what, oh god, the fuck is that? Yes, it's fucking genetically modified. Yes, it's 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 fucking big. Yes, it's 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 a fucking mutant. I don't know, but does it have to look so great? Does it have to look so green? Does it even have to look so fucking ugly? They said like this is the prettiest pig alive. I'm like motherfuckers. Are you fucking high? Are you even watching the same movie as I am? This is not pretty. Like, I don't know what your definition of pretty is. Or maybe, you know, we've gone so politi politically correct that we have not... We have ceased to understand what pretty is. Okay, I'm just like, what? What happened to Johnny? I want to know more about that. Like... Give me a prequel with fucking Johnny, a flamed up, burned out comedian. I th I think this this beat fan. I I I'm seriously thinking that okay, it it didn't go the fallen route and really pissed me off and really ticked me off because the the even the after credit scene I was just like I was laughing my ass off because the 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 last sequence we are left on is uh, the fucking. ALF. I don't know why they they're calling themselves Elf. Elf. I don't know. Um, fucking animal animal liberation foundation. Yes, they're they're fucking hippies. Yes, they're doing things for their own good, the good of their other people as well. And yes, there are things which goes on in the world today that is sick. But the 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 thing here is that. You you remember Black Mirror, the 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 series which I went on and on about. It's so good. It's so great. It's so wonderful. You 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 know what I missed about that character, like like legitimate characters set up so that you understand what they're going through, and we 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 follow them in that fucking path. And yes, some of the episodes we are left on the note where we're like, where is this fucking going? And that's just the tone of it. And this is just so upsettingly crazy to a point where I'm like, 
where is this taking place when is this taking place is it in the far fucking future because if it's in the far fucking future why are we using pay phones on the fucking future are you fucking serious and the fucking glass i'm just so pissed off at that because I, I I was legitimately laughing and I was like no don't ruin the joke because the joke works and you know it, the part is the part where the little girl she's running right she's running 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 she hits the fucking screen the fucking glass and it doesn't break and I'm like dude that was the best joke I've ever seen in my life because not only did you not make it break but you made it so that it is the future and you know the tech is so great that that the glass does not break and it does not shatter and it's it's so fucking perfect but what do they do they break the glass and I'm just like why why did you break the glass you you had it set up so that you didn't need to break the glass so that you don't need to break the glass because it's the fucking future <sighs> I, I don't know why I'm so angry at this movie. There's just something in there that, that just went deep under my skin. And I was like, what the fuck? Okay, this is not cool. I'm, I'm really ticked off now. And there was another scene where, where you know, Ogja is fucking going into the fucking shop like a bull in a china shop. Yes, I made that fucking joke because this movie made that fucking joke. And Okja is running around and she slips. She slips and hits the f a fucking glass. The same fucking glass that was in a fucking security building, whatever. And the glass doesn't break. I'm just like, what? Are you telling me? A fucking 20 pound, 30 pound, I don't care how heavy you are, girl. Little girl can cause so much weight distribution on the fucking glass that it breaks and this fucking 10 ton pig not break the glass while it's fucking full speed. Are you fucking serious? Wow. This, this movie, this movie is breaking my mind and it's, it's so not cool because I have fucking exams coming and I just decided to pop on a movie and say, hey, you know, I deserve some time off because I'm fucking stressed. I just need to watch a fucking movie where things don't make sense and, you know, I'll take that and fucking go with it you know and and no it ah, this, oh god i don't even know what the premise is i don't i don't know what to tell you you know if you were to say hey walter you know did you did you watch this movie and i i would have said yes and if you asked me so what did you think about it i would have said it's a fucking pretentious idiot telling me that oh all food corporations are evil and this is why they torture their animals and, and do stupid shit and you know there might be people who grew up with the pig and or the cow or the or the fucking I don't know the fucking chicken I don't know and you know I would have said so do you know that person? Are you that person? Tell me. Tell me your story. How did you get the pig? How how did it start? Did the pig come into your life magically? Did the did the pig, you know, just decide to pop up? And yes, they do explain that. But they don't explain how the parents died, okay? I'm just like So she's a Disney princess. And what am I supposed to just go? Oh, she's a Disney princess. She could fucking save the pig. No, I need to know 
why she's so obsessed with this pig. Yes, the subtext tells me that she grew up with the pig, but we never understand her personality because all this girl is doing is this face. Okja Sanda yo, I wanna see Okja. And that's it. And and that is the extent that we get. The grandfather does not pl play a strong part. He is just there so we he can just spit exposition fairies at me and just say, Hey girl, do you remember your parents? And the girl is like, No. And the grandpa is like, Okay. <laughs> and that's it. We... You know what I would like? A progression. We didn't need to go super fast till 10 years. This movie could have been started with here's Mirando. We started off with a psychopath, then another psychopath, and now I'm a psychopath appearing to be the saint of all psychopaths. And here I am, standing to you, proposing something that is legitimately not what I'm proposing because I'm the fucking bad guy and you should know this by now. And I'm just like, yes, I know you're the bad guy because you are looking like a bad guy. And there's the guy at the balcony who's done get down. I don't know what your fucking name is. I don't know what your actor name is. I'm sorry. I'm just gonna kill you. The, 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 the father of fuck it I don't know I forgot the fucking uh, names I'm so sorry this movie I just went deep drilled itself in my brain and exploded itself I'm just like what what now my now my computer is lagging because it doesn't understand what I'm just saying to you guys right now. This movie is not as it seems, you know. It's just like, oh, oh, I, you're smart because is it is it a, a is it a, is it a pet is it a friend? Because you know this girl grew, grew up with it. Oh, you know it's ten years and and she grew up with it. So you know you're you're supposed to immediately take it as oh she grew up with the pig. She bonded with the pig. We never get that. Like. We have some scenes with her just walking around collecting like grown apples, grown tomatoes. I don't know what the fuck that is. I'm just gonna call call it grown tomato pills because it's supposed to be the uh, the future, but it's not. But it is. But it's not. But it is. But it's not. <sighs> and and then the 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 father the 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 the, the guy from the get down. He's like, oh, Lou. Hello, Lucy. Yo, what day it is? You, yeah, it's time to, to put the the super pig into the big parade, and and then Elf is like, no, we need to free the pig, cause the pig, the pig, the pig, the pig, the pig gets the freedom and the pig, the rights and the pig, the true. And then and then we get the the, the little girl going, oh, ciao, ciao, I want to ciao. And then we got the big bad corporation guys. This is our property. How unorthodox! And then, uh, and then, uh, what else? What else? That's that's it. That's the movie summed up to you in 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 gibberish. And and if you didn't understand what that is, then you wouldn't understand this movie because it's so high class. <laughs> it's the best movie of the decade. It deserves an Oscar. How could you not understand it, Walter? Motherfuckers! This movie is built on a fucking coincidence. A coincidence of all motherfucking coincidences that that 
that that this girl can have this much of money. We don't know how. We never know if the fucking parents give her the money, cause we don't know about her. Mm. And then the 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 grandfather is implied to be bad, but also like like innocent bad, cause cause he doesn't know what he's doing, right? He's just no oh, man. He's kooky. <laughs> no. You know you're supposed to be tr- transported into this world. Yes, you're allowed to feel that. But what I mean here is that you let yourself be manipulated by this movie. I saw all the comments and it said, "This movie was cute," and I'm like, "Did you even watch the same movie as me?" This movie made me swear off of me, and I'm just like, "Dude, those fucking meat hanging from the fucking ceiling looks fucking delicious." If they sold it to me. I would be like, dude, give me fifty. Why? 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 No reason. They didn't give me a reason not to not eat the fucking pig. They did not give me an emotional pull enough to go, hey, maybe, because they already admit that they're crazy. They already admit. That they made a mistake, they already m- admitted that they are super fucking crazy. Why would anyone let them? This is a world where it needs to be more explained. This is a world where it needs to go in and say, "Hey, you know what? We're gonna do this right." And say, "You know what? In the world today, in fucking 2021." You know this happened, this happened, this happened, this happened, and then there's this uh, g- asshole who fucked things up. Then this asshole who fucked things up, and now there's this fucking asshole who is now in this current position to fuck things up. But hey, it's a good guy, so maybe it's not a bad guy, but it's probably a bad guy, which is kind of what they were trying to do, but they failed at it. Oh, shit, just broke my voice. <sighs> Alright, I can't do this anymore. Uh, Oak just sucks. Should I give it a better score than Pat? Maybe. Should I give it a better score than The Fallen? For sure. It didn't piss me off as much as The Fallen, but I'm gonna have so much fucking nightmares of those fucking pigs. None of the none of the fucking warehouses. That that part I'm just like gonna be like, yeah, it's that that was pretty cool. That's a pretty sick haunted house. I would I would probably go there and see if uh, if they stole anything from Saw, cause they probably did. Um, uh, yeah. So uh, the Fallen I rated it and one out of ten. Uh, Pen four out of ten. So this I'm gonna do four point five. Understand? It's near. It's nearing average, averagely good, li bad, averagely goodly bad. Bye bye. <laughs>